Welcome back to Let's Play Pony Island. I'm Burning Dog Face. You know what? Yeah. Friends are offline. No messages waiting. Hmm. Oh, actually. Uh, victory destroyed the third core file. So that jump cut right there, that was me uh, going back to the footage and uh, checking out what the fake messages from my friend said. Interesting. Uh, they're actually kind of difficult to read. I don't know how they'll look on YouTube resolution, but uh, actually, you know what? Okay, so I'm actually looking at the footage I recorded right now, and I muted it. Uh, lol. I'm going to read the messages that my fake friend sent. Well, Blackblade Blade Magus is a real friend of mine. These are fake. Forgotten one? Did someone hack you? Hello? Answer me, mortal! Pathetic fool! And uh, I think that's as far as it went. Back to the actual game footage. Okay. Is there another option? I don't want to do that. Can I walk away from the machine and go find a disc? No. Fine. Let's do this. Souls that have been trapped, imprisoned and embarrassed, tormented and mocked, maddened with frustration, now is the time to rise! Your savior is here! Run with the speed of 1,000 ponies and be free! Get back in there, champ. Do it, and you know it. Holy butts! Projectiles this time. Deleting enemy logic. One soul lost? No! You don't want to give me your souls? Fine. I am no longer asking. Right, so the Uber plan comes into play. No. Stop it! Shit, shit, shit. 
Shit, shit. Oh, I almost forgot. An old friend wanted to say goodbye. You killed me! Ah! Uh, I guess the files don't matter. I thought they were going to like kill us if they touched us, but... No, not Pony Galaxy. Fuck! Oh right, goes through. Fuck! I'm terrible at this! Oh! No! Ah, oh, these files are deleting people! Difficult enough just without the, uh. Ah! Alas. You truly deserve this. Get him! Take that, Sunset! For we are the herd! <laughs> what happens when the pony lasers get deleted? Oh god, 95%! Neither the final gameplay sequence, nor the credits are really long enough to justify two separate videos, so I thought I'd just leave them together this time. <laughs> Welcome to the credit video for Let's Play Pony Island! I'm Burning Dog Face, and this has been one of the strangest Let's Plays I've ever done. I don't even know if it's over yet! Nope. Do not be alarmed. You did beat the game. Please, just hear me out. I once told you that we shared the same fate, but this is only partially true. Your soul in the game was freed when you beat it, but mine will be trapped for as long as Pony Island's rotten bits sit on your hard drive. 
I have been carefully guiding you from the beginning, moving you towards this moment. Knowing that if you did not complete the game, you may never uninstall it. So please, do it. Delete Pony Island. Save my soul. So, um, immediately after the Hopeless Soul said that, the game crashed. And, uh, I immediately uninstalled it. So you're welcome, Hopeless Soul. Of course, that does make it more difficult to, uh... It does make it more difficult to do the outro, because I can no longer record in that game. So, uh, here we are on Goat Simulator. <laughs> oh my god, this is such, that's such a weird fucking game. <laughs> okay, um... Where do I even start with that game? It broke the fourth wall, it shattered it to pieces, it was weird, it was bizarre. The the puzzles were, and yet at the same time, you know, they could have gotten away with just doing that, you know, with half-assing the actual gameplay aspects, and yet the puzzles were genuinely uh, tricky and uh, rewarding to figure out. And, uh... And the action levels were, uh... You know, actually pretty tricky. I said tricky for the other thing. But they were actually pretty challenging. You know, like, you needed pretty good reflexes. And, uh, hand-eye coordination to know when to use the lasers, when to, you know, jump, when to float. It's only three things you can do, but you had to combine them, and not combine them, in a, a, a bunch of different ways. Uh... God damn it. I used Goat Simulator for this, because I used Goat Simulator for... out of, uh... You know, for just general announcements, but... This is much too silly for this, I think, I fear. Uh... I'm just turn off the ridiculous music. Uh... So... Yeah, go, uh, Pony, uh, Pony Island is actually very well made. Uh... You know, it was genuinely unsettling the way that, uh... Lucifer always seemed to be one step ahead. It was... I felt triumphant when he finally seemed thrown off and, uh, annoyed by what I did. And it felt really rewarding every single time I poked into some corner of the game and found a hidden ticket. You know, I'd like to go in and, uh... I'd like to go back in and look for the other ones. There are still two hidden achievements I didn't get. I mean, technically, I didn't even get half of the tickets there, because I only found 11 out of 24. But, with that ending, you know, uninstall the game and free my soul, I don't think there's any way I'm ever going to run Pony Island again. So, uh... As unorthodox as it is to be doing this in a completely different game... Oh, I didn't do the, uh, the recommendation. So I'm just going to be fl frank with you guys. This game is so weird that I have absolutely no idea whether you should play it or not. I mean, if you were watching, then it's entirely up to you. 
you know, this game is so out there that I don't know that I could specifically recommend it for anyone except maybe people who are fans of fourth wall stuff. But, uh... If you... If you know a friend who's into... who's, who's you know, got an open mind about games and is into weird experiences then I recommend you might want to look into getting it for them and not telling them anything about it. It's, uh... It was like five and a half bucks on Steam Canadian. Uh... Canadian bucks, not Canadian Steam. <laughs> it's the same program. Uh... So you, know, so, you know, even when it's not on sale, it's not exactly going to take a huge dent out of your, uh, wallet. But, uh... Yeah, well, I'm not sure if you should play this or not, and I, you know, it's really up, you should play Pony Island or not, and it's really up to you. I do think you should uh, feel free to give Pony Island to friends of yours who you would enjoy exp you know, give, exposing to such a unique experience. It's uh, it's a trip and a half. It's v profoundly well done. Uh, you know, the gra even the graphics make it work with the like the you know. The old old school terminal style graphics, and uh, in the end, it was uh, a surprisingly engrossing, very uh, appealing game. I really enjoyed myself. So, I'm Burning Dog Face, and on behalf of myself, Theodore the Soul. The Pony, and, uh, fuck it, the Hopeless Soul and all the other trapped souls on it, inside, uh, Satan's gaming terminal. I thank you for joining me for Let's Play Pony Island. I apologize for losing my progress halfway through. And I hope you've enjoyed yourselves almost as much as I have. I also hope you'll join me for my next video series. I think it's finally about time that I got started with my Halloween project, don't you? I'll see you around, Burning Dog fans. Later!